talk about X Factors guys for Florida, Sergey Bobrovsky. How about the X Factor potentially for Carolina, Steve, the penalty kill? It was 84% in the regular season, and so far in the postseason, it is at 90%. 27 out of 30 on the PK in the playoff. Yeah, isn't that amazing? And it's funny because a penalty kill, obviously you're keeping the other team off the board if it's effective, but you can also gain some momentum. And, Billy, there are some of the numbers you talked about. 27 for 30, that's darn near perfect when you're talking about two rounds of the playoffs. And for me, it really starts in your own zone, especially off a faceoff. And Jordan Stahl wins his fair share, and there's Stahl winning a faceoff. Brady Shea's going to jump by, but that's Martin, who we've got circled also. He's going to head north because he knows that's a clean win. Shea's going to get it. I know exactly what he's going to do, so I'm going to fly the zone, and I'm going to put some pressure on down ice, and that's exactly what he does. Shea makes the net, plenty of time off the glass, and yes, there's Martin, who doesn't get the puck, but he puts pressure on the puck, and, you know, all of a sudden, you've knocked 15 se seconds off the penalty kill. Loses this one, but I love the aggressive nature. Watch, and right there, that is Brady Shea again directing traffic. He sees Hughes. He wants Hughes covered, so Stahl's going to head to Hughes. That's Martinuk who's heading out to the other man, and there's the defenseman. And instead of just staying in that tight box, they're very aggressive. They're heading to the corner. Jordan Stahl coming back to help in front of the net. Jordan Stahl now heading to the corner. And again, Brady Shea realizes that Petchy's on his side. He wants him to get to the other side. They retain that box, and there's the pressure again. They're not allowing New Jersey to be good. They're not allowing New Jersey to get set up. Again, a bad pass, so they're pressuring the puck. Um, I love it. I, as a former penalty killer myself, I love it. like the way they protect the blue line. It's a three-man triangle, kind of a wedge. You try to force the guy to the boards. He dumps it in. Now, that's fast along the uh, boards. He realizes he's got support, so he's just trying to lift the stick, hoping that the defenseman Pesci gets to it. He doesn't quite get to it, but... Aho had checked his shoulder, realized there's nobody in front of the net. I can get to the boards because we win 90% of our battles along the boards. He gets the uh, loose puck, gets a goal in the other way. This is a shorthanded opportunity, almost a goal. So, uh, you know, Bruce, I, I, as a former coach, you know how important penalty kills are. I think they're just more important in the playoffs for whatever reason. They kill momentum. They get momentum going on your side, especially around the, on the road. And right now, Carolina, the best team in that respect. Well, How about I mean, that for a breakdown? That, huh? was, that was excellent. That was just excellent. And, um, and he's 100% correct on all of it. And, but, I mean, it's the pressure, pressure. But even uh, as important as that, it's all four guys moving at the same time. They're not pressure one guy going and then they make the pass and then another guy decides to go. They know exactly where they're going, so it, whenever they do make a pass, there's no time and space to make a play. And that's what's great about it. I like, played against them twice this year, and I don't know if we got a power play shot, let alone a power play goal. Like, I mean, they keep coming at you, and you're right. Like, it's, it's depressing for the, the team when you keep getting power plays against someone you can't even get a shot on goal. And, and so the momentum completely changes. So, I mean, and the, if you look at the rest of the series, is uh, how important the power play has been to certain teams. Mm -hmm. That, I mean, if you can nullify that power play and play and play the structured game of five-on-five five that Carolina plays, you're, you're in a pretty good position. 